James Nichols didn't seem particularly unnerved today by the latest revelations about his possible connection to the Oklahoma City bombing. I don't know where they come up with that. It's pure speculation, hearsay, and gossip. In documents grudgingly released by the Justice Department, FBI agents say a confidential informant told them Nichols talked in 1988 about using a mega bomb to blow up the Oklahoma City Federal Building. The informant allegedly said Nichols even went so far as to draw a diagram of the building to explain how it could be destroyed. Nichols says the informant didn't get the story straight. No, I never knew it existed until the bombing took place. I didn't know there was a federal building in Oklahoma. Nichols has not been accused in that incident. So far, his brother Terry and friend Timothy McVeigh are the only suspects charged. The more than 100 pages of documents were ordered released after a lawsuit by two Detroit newspapers. Included was an inventory of items seized during an exhaustive four-day search of Nichols Farm. Investigators cataloged over 300 different pieces of evidence they found. Among them, a blue plastic drum, similar to those suspected of holding the explosive mix used in the Oklahoma City blast. A spokesman for the FBI wouldn't comment saying only that the documents speak for themselves. As for Nichols, he says for now he has more important things to worry about than seven-year-old conversations. Sleeping, eating, and working, and that's it. I got to get in the new curfew, 10 o'clock, don't cut it. Terry Phillips, CBS News, Decker, Michigan.